For the last part of this lesson, we are going to focus on congruency, which is math speak for two shapes that are exactly the same. Let's apply this definition to triangles. These triangles are congruent because they have exactly the same three angles and exactly the same three sides. These triangles are not congruent because although they have the same three angles, they are not exactly the same. The one on the right is larger. If we can prove that two triangles are congruent, then we know that everything about them is the same. And this can help us to find any unknown sides or angles. We'll get back to how we can prove congruency in a minute, after this explanation on what we mean when we use the word corresponding when talking about lines and angles.